A new material was discovered on 26 January 2017. It has never existed on Earth before. It is the first ever sample of metallic hydrogen on Earth. This experiment was conducted by Professor Isaac Silvera and Dr. Ranga Diaz of Harvard University Department of Physics. Up till now, we have known hydrogen in a gaseous and liquid state. It is also the first element in the periodic table. It's a very simple element with a single proton and single electron around it. At room temperature, it is in gaseous state. But if you cool hydrogen down to a low temperature, it actually liquefies. And now they have found hydrogen in metallic state. So what they did was they made two synthetic diamonds sit at an opposite side in a device known as diamond anvil cell. And in between, they made hydrogen sit in liquid state. And then they started squeezing by applying pressure on the liquid hydrogen. That made it become solid due to high pressure. And this gets really amazing. Do you know how much pressure they had to apply on the liquid hydrogen to make it into a solid? It's more than the pressure that exists at the center of the Earth. It was somewhere around 495 gigapascal or more than 71.7 million pounds per square inch. And you know what is more surprising about this experiment? The hydrogen metal remain metallic even if pressure is taken off. Just imagine if it stays like this, that is in the metallic state, it can be used in wide range of applications. You can carry electricity from one place to another without any wastage by simply making wires from this material. Then the magnets that are used in MRI scans, currently they need to be cooled with liquid helium. Now with the help of metallic hydrogen, you won't be needing liquid helium coolant. Then launching a spacecraft requires liquid hydrogen as one of the fuel components. Metallic hydrogen will be more stable and it will release more energy in less quantity. That will easily allow us to explore outer planets. Now this experiment is also known as the holy grail of high pressure physics. Because just the sheer amount of pressure that was needed is unimaginable. So this was the whole story behind turning hydrogen in a metal. If you want to see more of such educational content, make sure you're subscribed. By doing so, you'll get an alert when my next video comes. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.